really fair about. This is Priscilla, the porcupine. So really excited about this technology. No one's doing it yet. This is an infrared camera and it picks up the thermal energy. We're really excited to partner with the Louisville Zoo to take some thermal images of the animals that they have here. With this, we can get a heat signature. White is going to be the hottest temperature. Purple and black are the coolest temperatures. Well, Louisville Zoo is always keen on looking at new ways to measure animal welfare. Look at the pixelation and see how it changes in different parts of the animal. And based on that, we'll know which regions work best to calculate heart rate non-invasively. So today we found that we were able to pretty easily get heart rate on both the orangutan here, Teak, and the porcupine. Teak works for his rewards. His training here is great and he has a great relationship with his keepers and he eagerly participated in training and got us the data that we needed. Anything we can do to help facilitate such research, we were thrilled to do. Maybe it can even be taken to the next step and help wild researchers do their work as well as even icing on the cake. Our goal is to image 50 different species. So far we've probably done about 30. Coming here to Louisville we've been able to access some animals that we haven't yet imaged. We were doing a Komodo dragon before and um, I think the scales may be too thick. So we don't know how certain physical characteristics like blubber or fur, fur thickness, um, feathers and scales might impact this technology. So it's things like that that I didn't really think would come up, but they're proving to be interesting. It's cool that we have this many animals to see what works and what doesn't. 